Welcome back, dear students. Uh, to in today's lecture, uh, we are going to uh, study a few examples of binary addition, and then we'll move on to binary subtraction. Okay, so look over here. There's an example. We need to add two binary numbers one zero 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 to the base two and one 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 one. One 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 to the base two, two binary numbers. Okay, over here. So let's do the addition according to the rules that we had studied previously. Okay. Now, now according to the rule we studied, we'll start from here. So zero plus one is one. Zero plus one again is one. Zero plus one again is one. And one plus one is Not two, but one zero. So this will be our answer. Isn't it easy? To the base two. Always indicate your binary numbers with the base two. Easy. Let's move on to the next one. Next example. Now the next in the next example. Look over here. There again. There are two binary numbers. One, 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 and the second one is one zero one one. And we need to add up these two numbers. Okay, so now let's see. One plus one is not two, but one zero. One plus one is one zero, right? So we will write zero, and we will carry or forward the one. We'll carry the one over here. Okay. Now then, now this one plus this one again becomes one zero. So we'll write this zero, and this one will carry over. Sorry, here. Okay. So zero plus one is one. Now one plus one again is one zero. So we'll keep this zero over here, and we'll carry this one over here. Okay. So zero plus zero is zero. Then one plus one is one zero. Okay, so we'll keep this zero over here and we'll carry this one over here. Okay, so now this zero plus one is one, and now one plus one is one zero. So what is the answer? One zero one zero one zero to the base two. Okay, isn't it easy? Okay, let's move on to the Next topic that is our binary subtraction. Binary subtraction. Again, before uh, carrying or uh, we're starting with the numericals, we will learn some binary subtraction rules. Let's look at the rules table over here. Look over here. Zero minus zero is zero. The first rule. Zero minus zero is zero. Then one minus zero is One one minus zero is one. Then one minus one is zero. One minus one is zero. But the important rule that is zero minus one. We need to pay attention on this particular rule. Zero minus one is one. Okay. Zero minus one is one. But when the number is borrowed, the number is borrowed. We need to uh. Understand one important rule: whenever one is subtracted from zero, sorry, whenever one is subtracted from zero, okay, the number is borrowed. Okay, it is borrowed. One is borrowed. Okay, let's. Uh, I'll make you understand uh, understand this rule with the help of an example. Okay, let's move on with an example. Okay. This example comes when we subtract one from zero. Okay, so let's quickly take an example. Look over here. There are two numbers one 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 and one zero one zero. Okay, and we are going to do the binary subtraction. Okay, so one minus zero is one. One minus one is zero. One minus zero uh, is one, and one minus one is zero. The answer is one zero one. 
okay this was pretty easy let's move on to a difficult problem this one okay uh, it's not difficult it's just that the exceptional rule applies over here so there are two numbers one one zero zero and the another number is one one okay and we need to subtract them. so see here we are subtracting one from zero see this one is subtracted from this zero right so when one is uh, you cannot subtract one from uh, zero because zero is nothing zero means nil so you cannot uh, when something is nil you cannot subtract anything from it okay so what we are going to do we are going to borrow from this number but this number again is zero yes so this number will borrow from this number okay so when one so this number will borrow one from this number and this number will become one zero it will become one zero and one zero means two right one zero means two if you remember in the previous uh, class i explained you that in binary one zero means two so actually this one zero has two ones inside it okay and this will become zero okay now see because one was borrowed from here so this one has become zero and this zero has become one zero now this one zero can give its one to this one and this now this number will become one zero this zero has become one zero and be, now and this will become one okay now let's do the subtraction so one zero means two one zero means two right in decimal okay binary one zero means two so one zero minus one is one okay this became one this became one na? right this became one so one minus one is zero okay one minus one is zero and this was zero itself so this is zero and this became one as it is so the answer is one zero zero one okay i hope you understood binary subtraction okay in the next lecture we are going to study binary multiplication okay thank you for listening take care of yourself and be well